to Springboard Media's Active Tips. I'm Amanda Urbanzik, Teaching and Learning Coordinator. Today's Active Tip is a little hard to explain. It's about what they call tool tips, or little menus that pop up that gives you hints about objects or text on your page. Let's see what it looks like. So here's a page I've already set up to have these tool tips. And when you hover the mouse over certain parts of the text, you can see little hints pop up. So I could put a definition in there, I could put some other information in there that I might want students to know. And when I'm not hovering over it, it's gone. So here I've defined what physical, political, and thematic maps would show. So how did I do this? All right, let's start with this blank page. The first thing I need is some text. The second thing I need is the Properties Browser. So I'm going to grab over here and get my, bra my browsers and pin them over here. So the fifth one in, this one that looks like a sheet of paper with a whole bunch of information on it, is your Properties Browser. And right now there's nothing that says Labels because I only have the whole page selected. So I'm going to select the object that I want to add a label to. And Label comes up right here. If you don't see it, it's a couple down from the top, right below Position. So here this first box asks you to add your caption. You can choose the font and the font size. And you can add the, you can change the font color, the outline style, the background, and the background color. So let's make it look yellow like a sticky note. Now here, this behavior button is what you want to check to see if that is always on or if it's the tooltip. The tooltip means that when you hover your mouse over that object, it'll appear. So I'm going to change it from always on to tooltip. So now you can't see it, but if I click off the page and click back on hello, it says this is a greeting. You can create a different tooltip for each text box on the page. So you could do this for vocabulary words and have a hint come up. You could do this for the objectives to give some more specifics as to what was going on with different things in there. You could do this in a lot of different ways. You can also do this for an image. If you want to put images in and then use this labels button to create a label that describes what the image is of. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's active tip. Springboard Media offers a wide range of professional development courses and workshops. Check us out at springboardmedia.com backslash Promethean.